Hey y'all, welcome back. I got a very quick little teeny bag. This bag was a jewelry bag rather. This bag, I got some broken nails. I'm getting ready to do them. $12.81, but I got sent, but I got this on Thrifty Thursday at um, Thrift World. So it was $6.40. And then I got two other pieces of uh, jewelry from them. Two or three. Two. I got these earrings. These are sterling silver. You know what? Something about it just did it for me. It looks like it has a uh, black enamel. That's not an onyx or anything, I don't think. But um, they're pierced. And they were eight, $8.99, so $9, two, $4.50, $2.25. $2 a minute. No, they were 50% off. Wait a minute. I think they were 50% off. They weren't 75 So they were $4.50. Not bad. You see that? And then, I didn't even look at the back. The back says what? It says, uh, Mexico and T-E something 20 and 925. But, yeah. Not bad. Boop. Drop the, <laughs> the back on it. But, yeah, they weren't bad. For $4.50, and, and this is something I would wear. I would wear that definitely. So I got these for myself. Look at how thick that silver is there. Not bad. I found another store. I'm gonna go, if I don't get there tomorrow, I'm gonna get there Wednesday. And um, they have $1 items for you local people. I'm gonna go check it out because I don't know what it is. I don't like telling it until I um, check it out. And then on the 24th, here's another one up for you guys, for you local and even check in your areas. Closet Mentor. They have their stuff a bag for $15 sale. It's a lot more rules. So I'll be posting that for you before the 24th. This has these little, um, can y'all see that? You see the little, um, these are sterling silver, but it has something on there. It looks like a, like a goddess or something. I don't know what that is um, on here. And then it got a little something and they just have a couple of these shells and a couple of that. And it was sterling silver. I thought that was cute. A little charm like bracelet. I got it. And this was $9.99, but so it came to $5. Whatever. No biggie. And then the bag. And the bag was, again, like I said, $12.81. So it was $6.40. And, $6 and, uh, okay, I'm going to open it up real quick. And I'm just going to go through this stuff real quick. I'm trying to make some bags up for the, uh, for the um, booth. So a lot of this stuff is going to be in my bags. Okay, somebody was selling this somewhere for five fifteen dollars, and it's the this green, look like a stone, feels like a stone. Yeah, some type of a stone. I don't know what that green is. That's pretty. It has a nice little closure, but it doesn't say a silver. Cute. And this they were actually selling that for two ninety. I'm not going through what they was because you know everything was in the bag. So, let's just do that. Everything was in the bag. And um, so, it was one price, $6.40. For everything else I'm showing you. Not these. These I brought separate. So, everything else is going to be for that. Okay. Then I got, got a little tangle here. This. This is a Barbie. No, it's not. It's a Barbie. Libra. It's kind of faded out. Libra. And it has the little stones on there. Yeah, this is kind of faded out. Yeah, not that good of a deal. Okay. Then we have this necklace. This is rather cute. Rather cute. Nothing expensive, but look at that. Look at this. Nice shine on it. I like that. I like that a lot. And then... Uh, I got this one. Let's see what we're working with here. Come on, thing. Okay. Um. Oh, that's cute, too. Look at that. And then it has pink microbeads with gold. Pink and gold microbeads. Y'all see that? It's nothing expensive. It's not even marked with a name. But that's cute. And it's one of these uh, little chokery. Uh, not quite a choker, but just very close up on your neck. That ain't bad. 
and then uh okay a glass piece and this isn't marked either with like a ribbony i would take that ribbon off but i think that glass piece is cute look at that and it's no rhyme or reason it's just like some glitter set in the glass cute that's the back and that's the front that's not bad it's not bad at all okay yeah i gotta get some more jewelry down to the booth i ran out down there okay let's see what this is okay, do i see anything on here i can't tell if that's marked or not i can't okay it's kind of cute though look at this look at these the way this connects right it's got this kind of connection like that like this looks maybe handmade or something you see and then it has all of these little crystals crystal chips all different kinds look at that and then it comes down to the spider with a piece of turquoise here and it's, the spider's holding a smaller piece of turquoise there. That's real turquoise. That's cute. So I'm, I don't know if this is real silver or not. I'm going to have to check it out. I don't see any marks. This looks handmade. I'll see. Okay. We'll see about that. Then we have... This is cute. This is glass. Oh, yeah, glass beads. Oh, wow. I don't, no, that's no clasp there. It's no clasp. It's just something that could go over your head. But look at that. That's green. Green glass. That is gorgeous. I'm liking that a lot. I like this. And it has a little tassel. Very pretty. I like that. I like this glass piece, but I don't like the ribbon. So I don't know. I'll hold that to the side. That black is pretty. I'm See, I don't need to be collecting no more jewelry up, y'all. None. Okay. This is a keychain. Or a, a bag hook. You know, handbag hook. I don't know what. I was trying to see if it said something, but no. Okay. Got these little dangles. And then here's the hook. Take this off. The dangles... And the hook can clip on to something. Okay, we have, oh, these are cute. They're not spectacular. Uh, they're cute. They're fierce earrings. They're cute. Got a little age to them. Okay, a micro bead. Ooh, ooh, I don't want to pull that tape off because it'll break it. A micro bead necklace with the um, barrel type of uh, attachment. You know what I mean. Okay. Oh, my gosh. I haven't seen these in so long. Does anybody remember that plastic stem that went through for your pierced ear? It's plastic. <laughs> wow. I hadn't seen that in a long time. Okay. I'm going to a little better. Here's another keychain, it's a um, horseshoe. Mm -mm. Another little keychain with a horseshoe. And a Renaissance collection, genuine fossil stone. What is so fossil stone about this? I don't know. It's kind of cute. I like the pendant. I don't like the, the um, rope that it's on. I like the pendant because I like all the shine it gives off. It's really pretty. That's pretty. I might have to look at keeping that pendant. Um, didn't I just say I ain't need to keep nothing else? What is wrong with me, y'all? Uh-oh. Wait a minute. What's that? Three ninety nine. It says what? I don't know what this is. I can't see it. That's pretty though. Look at this. 
I don't think it's anything. Maybe it might say Avon. I couldn't tell. Look at that. How delicate that is. That is so pretty. So pretty. Look at that. It's really cute. And then we have a watch that is by Kathy Ireland. It's cute. Nice little face. Classic. Nice leather band. A classic face. Look at how classic that is. What was that? Navy blue, actually. That's blue and uh, with gold. That's pretty. Kathy Ireland. Okay. Then we have... I didn't do this live because this is the middle of the day, guys. I'm just going to put this up. Just, like I said, to get through some of this jewelry. Um, okay, whatever this is, is broken. Whatever that is, is broken. I don't know what that was supposed to be in some blue micro beads. And blue and gold. So, I don't know what that was supposed to be, but it's broken. Okay, and then we have... A BFF ice cream. <laughs> so, you know, this is like Claire's or something. The One of them BFFs was, oh, Best. It just says Best with the ice cream cone. On a little latchkey kid chain. And then we have, oh, God, this is a mess. Mm. Okay. Oh, this is, again, something very delicate. This is a bag of delicates. Delicate is nothing um, to write home about. Oh, this goes with these earrings. It goes with those earrings that I had. Look at that. Maybe it doesn't. I thought it did, but no. Now looking at it closer, no. That's pretty, though. Because it looks like it could have... I don't even know where I put the earring. In one of these piles I'm making over here, the earrings are. But yeah, those little earrings, but it's not that. But very delicate. Look at that. So cute. Really cute. Okay, what's this? <laughs> this is sterling silver. Y'all, here's another thing. It came in a pack like this, right? I bet you it's not silver. So sterling silver. I don't know where my uh, kit is, and I still have been hoping to find it and haven't purchased another one. But it's going to be time to get one anyway, because the time's going to run out on that. Because, you know, you, those acids you have to replace. I don't know. It could be. But it says 925. But it came from China. Indonesia. So, it might be. I don't know. Okay. Look at that. It's a swan with a faux pearl. I know that's a faux pearl. It says from Indonesia. Sterling silver. I'm going to have to get this checked out and see. I'm going to have to check it out. I'm just going to have to break down and buy the kit again. I'm going to have to. It's trying not to. That's cute. You see that little pendant? It says Sterling Silver, 925. It says it on here. And it says it on the um, veil here. The um, veil right here. And it says it on the... ST, it says it's Sterling Silver. STS. And it says Indonesia. Yeah, so we'll see. I'll check it out. I don't call it when it's... Pet, things like that, I don't call it until I actually see it. <laughs> so, I'll just hold off on that. On the results of that until I can test it. Okay, this is, again, something very, very cute. Not any kind of precious metal, but cute and dainty. Look at that. It's on a silver chain. The chain is in very good condition. Silver tone. The chain's in very good condition. Really cute. Throw that in the bag. I don't need to be saving none of these things just because they're cute. I got to get rid of this stuff. Okay, then we have, it looks like a flower imprint right here in this little pendant. And then it's just a very thin silver tone chain. It's kind of cute. Again, dainty. Um, I started to do that mirror that I told y'all I was going to show y'all how I did it. The ones in my bedroom. But I ran out of glue, so I didn't have, couldn't find any glue sticks. So I just said, I'll do it. I'll do it this week. Next time I get out to the store. Okay, we, um, I gotta go out and get 
Dollar Tree. Also, all I need is those glue sticks. And I just don't feel like going out. Okay, look. Cute. Micro bead multi strand. Little, small little necklace like that. Cute. And this is like a clear. So it looks almost silvery, but it's clear. Cute. Really cute. And this is a bracelet, maybe? Yeah. A bracelet with the, um, whatchamacallit? I forget what that symbol is. Something of life or something like that. And it goes like this. Uh -uh. Turn over. Like that. Cute. Or it could be an anklet. I would go as far as to say, because this is nice and long. This could be a nice anklet. Cute. Okay, we've got a bracelet here with blue stones and gold balls. And I don't see that it where it might say something, but I'll check it out. I don't think it's any kind of, I don't think that's real gold, but look at the blue stones there. That's that blue stone that looks like blue denim. And I can't think of it, y'all. I ain't gonna sit here and tell you something I'm not sure of. But the chips, really cute with the gold balls. And it's just a bracelet with the um, barrel closure. Okay, then we have another necklace that's caught up with something else. Oh no, okay, is this a necklace? Oh no, this might be one of them headbands. Look, goes over your head like that. And the multi-strand, um, multi-colored micro beads with the elastic in the back. So I guess if you really was needed a necklace, you could use this as a necklace. Or you could put it around the head like this. Yeah, y'all know what I mean. I ain't trying to. Yeah. Okay. Ah, dual jewelry. Save your space. Okay. Then we have an owl. On a gold tone. I meant silver tone chain. It's a nice lint to the chain too. Look at that. And then here's the owl. He's cute. And I thought, I, you know what? I thought this bag had, didn't have this much in it. So I was like, oh, I can knock this out real fast. <laughs> nope, it got a lot in it. A silver tone chain, no markings. It's like the twisted. Yeah, I don't think it's anything. Um, nah, it's not. It's cute though. Cute, that's cute chain for a pendant. If you need to uh, have a little pendant, you need to put something on. That ain't bad. Okay, and this is all twisted up right here. I don't know what's hooked up in here. Let's see. We got a, a little Oreo cookie looking thing with glitter on one side. And this is all tangled up, y'all. Let's see if I can get this one loose. Ah the worst oh this is really pretty look at that glass beads look at that black glass beads that is gorgeous chain is in good shape too really pretty close to your um neck what's that your delicate or what is that called y'all step tell me cute and then we have this another chain no markings, nobody's name. And uh, it's just a silver tone chain. Very pretty though, look at that. Like a box style, cute. Okay, we have this nice little chest filler piece. And when I say chest filler, I mean it fills up. You know, if you wanna wear your shirt open or a um, V-neck or even over uh, like a sheath dress that comes up to high, just, you know, fills in your chest. That's all. Ain't that pretty? I like those, I like this green. For some reason, I'm really liking this to the point where I really want to keep it because I know I could use this this fall. It's pretty soft green. Oh yeah, I think I'm gonna keep that. <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying, y'all. Okay, uh oh, what is this? I don't see any marks, that's cute. That's cute. 
It's wood beads with this. Are these wood? Yeah, they're, no, those paper beads. The beads is made with paper. And then you have your clasp right here. I don't see a marking on the clasp or anything, no. Where it might say uh, 925, because it looks like it could have been silver. But I doubt it. Okay, no. No marking anyway. It doesn't mean it's not silver. But look, it's a men's necklace it looks to be. And no markings. Is that cute? Really cute. And then, um, oh, can I get this untangled? This is the worst feeling when your stuff gets all tangled up coming out of these bags. Wait a minute. Okay. You know what? There you go. Got it apart. Okay. And now this side's hooked. Okay. Got these little earrings. Oop, that was way too close. These little earrings, nothing spectacular. Nothing spectacular, but cute nonetheless. And then we have this chain. It has pink bows on it. Mm -mm. See? Come on, thing. Turn around. Pink bows like that. And they're just going down the chain. Gold tone. And a uh, little kid's bracelet. A little kid's bracelet with that. And then it hooks like this with a little magnet underneath. Cute, but. Yeah, this is all mangled up here. And I don't want to break it because I can't see what's what. I'm going to take my time. And so I'll show you while they're still hooked. Okay, this one just came off. This, look at that. That's so pretty. That is so pretty. And it's just on a long chain. You know, gold tone, but cute. Turn thing really cute look like it has some little age to it okay now these are connected what is that Nothing. these couple chains are connected and i'm not going to waste the time on these so i'll show you like i said this right here is a, a cross pendant on a um wait a minute it goes this way this cross pendant on a silver tone chain is silver toned you see it's nothing major then we seem to have a leaf on a ring, pendant with silver tone chain. And then we got a whole bunch of everything all mangled up there. And yeah, that's it on this. That's And that cookie thing I showed you, this is a mess. I'll, I'll untangle that later. And what is this? Okay, again, another piece that looks like it might have some age to it. And then we have this. Another page, again, gold tone, like an antique gold tone. And that, that's pretty. Oh, I like that stone, look at that. This is glass, a glass piece. That's pretty. Oh, that's really pretty. Look at the cut, faceted cut on there. Look how it makes the dim dimensions in that piece of glass, that's pretty. It's really nice. And then we have, is this silver? Uh, let me see here. Oh, it doesn't have a clasp. It just has this. It could be. I'm going to go as far as to say that I'm pretty sure that these pieces are silver. Um, but I don't know. I oh, know I'm not. I am so not going to say that, y'all. 
<laughs> I ain't gonna sit here and lie to y'all. I am so not gonna say that. No, I'm gonna say that you got some little pendants on the chain. That's what I'm gonna say. Got this little thing here. I thought the tarnish at first, I thought it might have been. You got that, and then you got this little thing, and and then a bird. Yeah, but I, I am not gonna go as far as to say that. I'll take that back. Okay, then we have a key. With half of its chain in here, this, I don't, yeah, nah, nah. It's a nice herringbone chain, right? But it's fake as anything I've ever seen. Yeah, fake herringbone. Yeah, it looks like at one point it was gold. And it's turning, you know, it lost all of the gold tone. Yeah, nice fluid to it, though. And then we have this right here. This The chain was in a bag, but this is the what it has on it, a key. Now, you know what? I keep getting keys. I don't know. I got to look that up, y'all, to see. Why do I keep getting these keys? What's the universe trying to tell me? A key. And then, because um, in the last, I'm going to say five or six bags I had, I found a key. Blessed. Yes, I am. Yes, I am thing. And it's on this crochet. Yeah, some kid made that. Okay. Oh, look at these earrings. Does it say anything? No. Mm-mm. Ooh, look at this. Fancy. Okay. Wait a minute. Let's get it so y'all can say. Okay. Look at that. These look like they're like Middle Eastern or something. Like, you know. I don't not know the right way to say it, but don't they? I mean, they look really pretty. So pretty. I don't see any marks or anything. Mm -mm. Pretty. I like those. Um, I would never wear them, but they're cute. Okay, here's another little dainty piece. And uh, no, nothing. Another little dainty piece. Look at those roses, guys. Oh, my goodness. That is so pretty. Now, I do not want to keep this. But even if I could just get one wear out of that with those roses, look at that. Yeah, that's pretty. I'm not going to keep it. There. No. Getting this stuff out of here. Here's a watch by... It doesn't have a mark. It doesn't have a mark at all. Cute. And it's a, a cuff type watch. Let me get that off of there. It's a cuff type of watch. Cute. Very Southwestern. Um, okay. Oh, this is pretty. I don't see a mark on here, do I? Nope. Mm-mm. Nah, no mark, but I just think it's so pretty. Look at that. Now, there, it's not anything that's real pearl or anything. I'll take that off later. But look at the clasp. Ain't that pretty? Clasp. And then this just full. It looks, it's heavy. It feels like it's very well made. It feels like it should have somebody's name ha uh, tag hanging off of it. But I like that. I, this is one I think I might keep because it's a classic. I would I might use that down the line. Okay, then we have I had I was gonna cheat on y'all one way or the other. So I was like, if I don't pull out this um this camera, I'm cheating. So I just grabbed the camera. Okay, this is needs to be unraveled, but look. Yeah, um, it takes a special kind of person, but somebody could wear that. See, it ain't too bad. It would need to be kind of sorted, I guess. Yeah, ain't bad. Look at the little thoughts. It ain't bad. It's for somebody. It ain't for me. Okay, another. This is pretty. Again, I don't see a name of any kind, but look at this. It's a bracelet. Now, look at that. Wait, let me get it so y'all can see it. 
Look at that. The little flowery things made up of uh, the rhinestones, black rhinestones. Did this this might have went with one of those necklaces. I'm going to look and see. That is very pretty and it has the toggle. That is so pretty. I have to keep that. See, this is my problem, y'all. This says Jesus. Nice bracelet. It's one of those adjustable ones. Jesus. And um what is this? Oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's one of those um Saint, who is it? Saint somebody. Purgatory. No, not purgatory. Per Pergarini? Saint Pergarini? Ooh, Saint Pergarini Sterling. Look at that. It says Sterling right up top. I don't know if y'all can see it. Saint Pergarini is Ster that's the first time I found one of these that was Sterling. Look at that. That's pretty. Okay, wait. And let's see if his chain is for Sterling. Yes, 925. So we got a Sterling chain, and it needs to be cleaned, and the pendant. Say Pergarini? Per no. Maybe I'm Ed. You know. Yes, Pergarini. Yes, that's what it says. P E R P E R E, right? P E R E G R I N E. Pergarine or something. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's not bad. And then, okay, that's cute. Again, very delicate, but nothing that's forcing me to keep it. Look at that. Very delicate. Silver tone chain. This is a nice bag for somebody who just wants some jewelry to get through, you know, like with a new wardrobe and um, just want some jewelry to wear to work. Okay, this is, I don't know, is this a bracelet? I don't know what that is. It might be, and it's just all twisted up. No, I don't know what this is, y'all. I don't know what that is. It doesn't tell you. It might be for your hair. Maybe it's for your hair. It says bead treasures, gold tone bead treasures. I don't know, y'all. Oop, my battery. So I'm almost done. Just got my first warning for the battery. Okay, we got this earring. Not bad. And then what else is over here? Okay, this a copper um, type of uh, bracelet. You know, the three metals, supposedly. That's not bad. Yeah, soldered together. Okay, and then we have this watch that is by Timex. It's a nice age to this one. Nice age to that. Timex watch, it has the gold tone stretchy. And then this one that is by, nobody, it says quartz. That's pretty though, look at the mother of pearl. That's pretty. And it's a leather band on that one. And then we have this chain. Oh, this is one of them eyeglass things you hold your eye when you, you know, where your readers. It's just a um, gunmetal color chain and with the hooks for the glass. And then we have some cufflinks. And, well, cufflink. And it's not marked. No, I can see. It's not. This is a, a little pin. Lapel pin or, you know, I wouldn't go as far as call this a brooch, but... I guess you could. Seashell. And then we have this. It's nothing major. Nothing exciting about it, but cute. It's fading out. Okay, we got another silver tone chain. And is that marked? I, don't, I can't see no more. No, I don't think so. Okay, come on now. Don't tangle up. That's cute. I don't see no mark on here. Looks like it could be silver, but I don't see any marks. Really looks like it could be silver. Look at that. That is so pretty. And it's not amber, but it's probably meant to look like amber. It's not amber. But it's meant to look like it. It's very pretty. It has like um, 
maybe dye that was poured into whatever this plastic was, but it doesn't look like amber is supposed to look. So, but that's still pretty, very pretty. I like that. Okay, and then we have these earrings. Let me open that. These are plastic and silver tone. It's a pair. And they're pierced with that hook in. Not bad. These are pierced shells. They got some age to them, gold tone. And that's some broken chain. Another, here's that, that blue chip again. And this is what? Shortcuts. I don't know, y'all, it's a different language. I think, yeah. What does that say? Wanderlust. Okay, that's cute. And then we have this watch here on a leather band. And what does it say? Nothing, it absolutely says nothing. Don't even say quartz. And then, oh, this is cute. Look at that. That's really cute. I don't, I, can't, I don't know if it's gold. Let me see if it's silver. Look, it matches what I'm wearing now. Um, I can't tell, but you know what? It looks like it possibly could be. This has a possibility of being silver. I don't see any marks, but I'll go over it really good and see. That has a possibility. Um, then we have this green and white with the gold ball. The chips. I don't know what that stone is. It looks like it's, um, whatchamacallit, um... Begins with an M. Can't think of it. I can't think of it. With that barrel clasp, too. Can't think of that green stone. With the black veining going through it. Okay. We got some more clip-ons. This is lavender. Like a purple and pink. Leaf style. Oop. Leaf style. And it's a clip-on. And then... That's some broken chain. There's a little ring. Like blue pearl going through, around it. Don't look like it's anything. Nah, nothing extravagant. Nope, but it's like a, um, looks like almost like a hex nut. I'm gonna show you this. See that? A hex nut with a, something that looked like mother of pearl going around it. Okay, mm, we got broken pieces of things. Here's that other earring we found in the beginning, the black. And then we got a broken wing. And this, here, oh, it's, it's okay. Not, yeah. And that's it, that's all we had today. So I'm gonna get this stuff packed up to get down to the, um, that's like a gold, a silver tone. And it got its little issues with itself. But that's it. So I'm gonna get some of this stuff packed up to go down to the booth. And I got some bags going down there. I didn't get down there today. It'll be tomorrow. But thanks a lot, a lot for joining me, guys, doing this bag. It was a quickie, but I just wanted to get it done quick. And I thought I would get it done quicker than this. But um, I'll see you guys soon. I know I didn't do it live. It's the middle of the day. It's early. And um, everybody's at work. So I'll pop back on. Maybe I'll do another bag during the week. Um, live in the evening, but I'll do it closer to 7-ish when everybody gets home. Okay, guys, I'll talk to y'all later. Thanks a lot. Please subscribe, like the video, leave me some comments. I know you guys got some comments about the jewelry. And then um, share my channel. That would be nice. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye-bye.